This presentation has been brought to you by all larger surfers around the world who have been held down, suppressed, in a world of midgets for the last 20 years. The large man can now reign free in the lineup to reclaim his position at the top of the food chain. Rusty is a large man. You, if you're still listening to this, are probably a large man. And the Rusty Big Cat is a good board for big surfers. Um, big guys have been held down for a long, long time because the average shaper was taking a six-tooth thruster and then just stretching it. So you ended up with a uh, what was called a big guy try, which is, if, if you're on a big guy try, many of you know that it just didn't really all work out all that well. Um, the reason is you stretch it, the board just ends up being too narrow, uh, too much rocker, not enough lift, and it doesn't fit in the pocket, so it does nothing well. Uh, the big cat has come from uh, two of Rusty's like most popular shapes, which are the Desert Island and the Moby Fish. If you take both of those boards and marry them into one shape, it'd be the big cat. Uh, what this board does really well is uh, it paddles really well, gets into the wave, and then surfs uh, like a short board on the wave. Uh, the Desert Island has always been really popular, but that's more of a medium to larger wave board. Uh, the, the Big Cat has a little bit wider, flatter nose template compared to the Desert Island. It has a wider tail. Um, you can see it's got a double wing swallow, but definitely wider than the uh, Desert Island. And then a good uh, double concave through the fins with a tri-fin setup. Uh, this board's available in three sizes, 7.0, 7.6, and 8.0 in tough light construction. Uh, this is the board we have right here is a 7.0. It's 7.0 uh, by 21 and a quarter by two and three quarters. So I mean, what this board does is it, it takes a lot of the hybrid shaping theories that are going on right now and, and just applies it to a board that's gonna work really well for a larger surfer. This is also a great board regardless of your size. Uh, if you are wanna skip longboarding altogether or if you live in a place with really not all that great waves you just want a little bit more float, a little bit more paddleability, uh, big Cat will do well for you and surf well in average everyday conditions. Rusty Big Cat.